Kirk here. I'm back in my studio working on another painting. I recently was contacted by uh, a very good friend of mine, Steve, and uh, he had a request. He said, Kirk, paint me a painting. I just went on vacation to Whistler, which uh, is a beautiful spot. A lot of people go there. Uh, it's a great tourist spot. A lot of people go there for vacation, skiing in the winter, sightseeing in the summer. And this is up in Canada, up in the Vancouver area. And uh, he and his wife took a recent vacation there in the fall. And uh, he says, Kirk, I need a painting. And he goes, all I want is, I want it to look like Whistler, maybe some mountains that you can tell are from the Whistler area, uh, particularly the Blackcomb Trail, views from the Blackcomb Trail. And, um, you know, as long as it looks like the area, and I want to have an image of my wife and I walking down a trail from behind, approaching an opening, uh, where, where they're going to have a panoramic view. So, I've put together this composite back here. I uh, found several images of uh, the mountain ranges there uh, off the Blackcomb Trail. That's Glacier Lake. You can see at the base of that mountain range and this is a well-known looking mountain range in the area and I'm gonna just show them from behind walking into this walking into approaching this opening here I still have a lot of work to do here yet I've got to add some highlights and there's I got to put more grasses and make this look a little bit more rustic but um, a lot of the backgrounds been done but now I think I've been really looking forward to putting them in the image and I have some images of the two of them and I'm going to go ahead and attempt to put them on the trail here now. And uh, for those of you that like to watch people getting painted, that is that is one of my specialties. And uh, I'm looking forward to doing that part of this painting. Um, I guess that's it at this point. And then after that, I'll finish up the rest of the foreground. And it'll also give me a little better idea as to what to paint in the foreground once I see where they're positioned on here. But... The height of Steve and his wife, they're going to be probably about that height right there. I don't want to cover up too much of the water, but I'm thinking his, Steve's head will probably be at the top of where my paintbrush tip is, and his feet down in here, and his wife right here. And then there's, you'll see more light coming through, and I'll show highlights on their clothing's, clothing once I get them painted in the way I want. But I'm, that's what I'm thinking. I'm thinking he's going to be about as long as this brush is. That's about how tall I'm going to show him in here, walking down, approaching the trail. And then his wife right here next to him, kind of, he's kind of helping her along. They'll be holding hands walking down the trail. But uh, I still got a lot of work to do, uh, particularly in the sky. I'm going to make this look a little bit more um, dreary with some highlights coming through splashing through sun rays coming on down onto the mountain which as you can see where I've already started this uh, the highlight line where the sun is coming through and picking up the trees and the, this dead tree here and some of the corners of this pine and the rocks still got a lot of work to do but that's what's next so I'm gonna go ahead and put Steve and Jean Jeannie uh, on the trail now alrighty let's get to it 